goodness that was a very long wait so i have been feeling super motivated i decided tonight i was going to get takeout for the first time i went to yoon's kitchen and i got a poke bowl she spoke to me in korean i understood the i part she spelled my name so wrong it says like Michelle. Michelle. but hey a for effort we're gonna go home and we're gonna have dinner ah, Salmon poke bowl. Look, my shirt matches the. No, I wanted to try the poke bowl this time. You don't want it? Okay. My parents have gone to get, it's either New Zealand or Auckland, but it's the best pies in New Zealand or the best pies in Auckland. Hopefully I can show you them uh, when they come back. A few moments later. So these are the pies that my parents got. Are these the best pies in New Zealand or Auckland? New Zealand. Oh, New Zealand. But they already had two, but we've got another one, two, three, four, five, six here. So this one is a chicken and cranberry, and I believe that's for me. There's like steak and cheese, a veggie one. We've kept the bags on them so we remember the flavors. <gasps> oh my god, how exciting. <laughs> There's a lot of cheese inside. But I don't seem to be able to find the cranberries. Oh no, the cranberries there. But this is what it looks like on the inside. They're actually not known for their chicken pies. They're more known for their steak ones. But I feel like there's not enough cranberry in it. There's, I've had like a quarter and I haven't tasted any cranberry. There is a lot of cheese. So it's good, but... Hi. Hello, hello, hi. It is now dinner time. I've got the congee again, but my dad made some handmade wontons, so I just put some sesame oil and soy sauce. This is just frozen fish. My favorite. Yum. Let's try one. All right, do it the taste test. Mm. 
Is it good? It's melted. It's melted, but still tastes amazing. So I got sent these cookies from Tiffany. She started this little baking company called Sugar and Temp. And look how good these cookies look. They are New York style chunky cookies. And it kind of reminds me of the Levain ones that I got uh, with Tony when we were in New York City. Look at how flippin' huge that is. That is a palm of my hand. That is how big they are. So I made a bit of a mistake, guys. However, we do have some left. The six cookies filled this entire jar. I still thought I would heat one up and show you what's inside because you can head over to my TikTok to watch it. But I don't want to do that because it's kind of annoying. I really want to show you guys here. <gasps> Ta-da! She put a lot of walnuts in there as well, which I love. I really wanted to show you what they look like before I end this vlog. Because I feel like it would just really annoy me if I didn't show you. So yeah, anyways, that is it for this vlog. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next vlog. Bye! I feel like I haven't ended a video in a very long time.